Hey there, this is Rebecca. Today we're going to look at diatomic molecules, also known as diatomic elements. Di stands for two, atomic for atom, molecules. So this means that they are elements that exist in pairs. Most of what you see on the periodic table are monatomic elements in nature. That means that they are singular atom elements. There are seven main diatomic molecules that we will look at where they exist as two atoms bonded together. The quick and easy way to remember the seven are also known as the mnemonic Brinkelhoff. Brinkelhoff stands for bromine, iodine, nitrogen, chlorine, hydrogen, oxygen, and fluorine. Bromine and iodine exist as liquids in room temperature, and you have the rest in gaseous state. The reason why we call them diatomic molecules as well is because molecule means two or more atoms bonded together. So as you can see, that clearly fits into the diatomic element description and hence why diatomic elements are also known as diatomic molecules. If you don't know the difference between what molecules and compounds are, I would highly recommend for you to click on the link above. There is a video to differentiate between the two, as well as examples to show which ones are compounds and which ones are molecules. Again, if you found this video helpful, it would mean a lot to me, as always, if you can hit the like button or subscribe.